Hey what's up guys, Jason here from Poor Man's Preparing and in this video we're going to check out this month's box, or I mean bag, from a pocket box. So let's get started. Alright, before we get going, I just want to say that the reason we have a bag this month is because one of the items were too big to fit into the box that they changed at the last minute, so they sent a bag instead. No big deal. i dispose of the boxes anyway, so let's go ahead and see what we got this month. Alright, before we get going, just in case you do not know, Apaka Box is a bi-monthly subscription service where they send you a lot of unique survival items to your door every other month. So, and it's only 50 bucks plus shipping, so it's great for those of us that are on a budget. But that being said, um, like I mentioned earlier, this theme is camp cookery. So we'll go over the items one at a time. It does not list a value, but I'll give you my opinion on them as we go. Alright, the first item up is this 5 liter Apaka dry bag. Very nice little bag here. If you don't know what a dry bag is, Basically, it's a, a waterproof bag. It's good for throwing your food or clothes in there. Then you just roll it up and take your buckles and buckle them together. And it is completely waterproof. You see, it holds air. See, it does good. This is a nice bag. It's really heavy duty. Plus, it has a a nice clear section so you can see. Uh, what you have in it in case you forgot or whatever see how much of something you have left without getting into it So it's very useful. It's pretty neat. I like that. It's a nice item. So you can roll off to a good start All right, so the next item up is, is there is the reason that they put the Apaka box in a bag this month and that is for this stainless steel pack grill blown back that this was in there Honestly, it's a uh, very big um, as far as using for camp, yeah, you could do that, if, especially if you're taking a vehicle and you don't have to walk very far. This would be great for camp. You know, just grill your steaks or whatever right on it over the fire. It would be uh, very nice. So, uh, very cool item again. It's 12 by 12. That's a pretty good size. I mean, you could throw four good steaks on there if you're camping with you, your family, or your buddies or whatever. So, yeah, a very nice item. You got some nice wood handles here to hold it. But yeah, cool item. So far, so good. Let's move on to the next. Alright, the next item up right here we have in this bag is a Campcraft Breakdown Tripod. And if you don't know what that is, basically it's a tripod that screws together. There's three pieces to each leg. And uh, you can set it up to hold a pot over a fire so you can cook with. And I'll set that up right now so you can check it out. Alright guys, here we see the tripod. It comes in three different pieces. You got a bottom one there. It screws into this piece here. Screws into that piece. And then it screws into uh, the main piece right here. All three legs screw into that. And it has this chain here that you can adjust where you hold your pot. How high up and down it goes over the fire. Then it has this pin right here try to do this one-handed you slide it into the chain to hold your pot up so it won't fall and then you can cook right over top of your fire that would be down here below all right back to it now that's a pretty cool tripod like i said very nice item then the next item up is this u.s grown chicory coffee chicory root is an incredible natural resource and like you see here you can make coffee from it i don't really know much about it um, you know other than that so pretty cool item give me some I don't necessarily like coffee or I don't like coffee actually but I'll give this a shot and see what it tastes like maybe I'll like it never know so that's cool I get to try something new all right and the next item comes in this bag and it's called the whiskey scoop and basically it's a little tool to help you carve a spoon and get it all out here and it comes with a block of wood to let you make a spoon as well. It came with this sheath. I took it off. I was showing PGP. But yeah, it also came with paracord on it. 
but I took it off because it just gets in the way, I think. All this stuff is handmade, so it's very unique, and you know, that's what really makes a pocket box pretty cool because you won't find uh, these items anywhere else. It's pretty cool to get handmade, unique items each month or every other month. But a pocket box also has a skills challenge each month, and this month is no different, and the skill challenge is carving a wooden duck spoon. And they want you to do that, of course, with the included piece of wood there and the whiskey scoop that they sent you. And I've started there a little bit. You know, it's pretty cool. Alright guys, so that makes up this month's Apaka box, which was camp cookery. Overall, the items in this box were terrific. They're all high quality. I'm very interested to make this duckbill spoon. But overall, like I said, this is a great box. Uh, at first I thought maybe... Uh, it could have used an extra item or two, but the more I think about it, look at it, and look online at the value of some of these items, uh, I think this is a pretty decent box, and you get your money's worth. So that thought changed rather quickly. Uh, it never hurts to get extra items, though, right? Right. All right, but that is it, guys. Let me know what you think about this box down in the comments below. And if you want to check out a pocket box, you can go to mypocketbox.com. That will be linked in the description. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to give it a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more. And remember, be ready.